Hello YouTube, Farmer Son Prepping here. Uh, I've been outside, it's cold today, plus I just opened this door, I've had this room shut off to conserve heat. This is the end room on the house. So uh, if I'm not in here, typically I keep the door closed in the wintertime to keep the heat over there by the TV and my chair and all that stuff. Uh, so today I'm going to do the uh, the 10 questions that I said I would do that uh, I saw Mountain Grandma do on Facebook. Uh, some of these questions I don't really understand and a couple of them, a couple of them are like the same question but in a different way uh, to me. But okay, here we go. Uh, I had to write all this down because my stupid tablet wouldn't work. Technology, don't you just love it? What's your favorite Christmas song? As a kid, we always played, Mom was a huge Elvis fan. Probably still is. Uh, we always played the Elvis Christmas album uh, when I was a kid. It was part of our tradition that we did in our family. And as a kid, my favorite song was Santa Bring My Baby Back To Me. Okay. But uh, as an adult, that has changed to Oh Holy Night. Uh, doesn't matter who's singing it. If you listen to the words of that song, Oh, holy night, the stars are brightly shining. I can't sing, but uh, that is my favorite Christmas song. That one just puts me in the Christmas spirit no matter where I'm at. Okay, next. Uh, I would do anything for love, but I won't do that. What would I not do? I would not be lied to. If I was in a relationship, I ain't going to be lied to. I'm done with lies. Uh, number three, favorite Christmas movie. This is a tough one. I don't even know if I can remember the title of the movie, but it's the one where uh, the little boy, he said, you shoot your eye out, and he said the fudge word one time. That's probably my favorite Christmas movie. Uh, Christmas, not Christmas Carol. I don't know what it's called. Christmas something. Uh, but that would be my favorite Christmas movie. Uh, number four, what do I enjoy most over the Christmas period? That would be church events, helping others. We give out fruit baskets to shut-ins, people who can't, you know, leave their home, people who are, you know, elderly and in really bad shape. Uh, handing those folks a Christmas basket, singing Christmas carols to them. I love that part. That's my most favorite thing. Serving others. Uh, when do I put my tree up? I don't always put a tree up. Depends on my mood, really. Uh, I have had depression in the past, and sometimes I still struggle with it, uh, being completely honest with y'all. Uh, but if I put a tree up, I've only got a four-foot tree because I got, I got dogs. Okay, I got German Shepherds with tails that come up to right here. Uh, so... When I, the tree I have was a little four foot tree. I put it on top of a table. That way the dogs can't get to it and knock it off or whatever. So when I put up a tree, it's a little tiny four foot tree. But when I put it up, if I put it up, because I don't always, but if I put one up, it's usually around the first of November. So long answer for that one. Sorry, y'all. Uh, Christmas dinner, turkey or ham, both. We are equal opportunity meat eaters in my family. We have both. We had both for Thanksgiving as well. Uh, best Christmas movie. I don't understand this. This is uh, kind of a redo on that other question. Best Christmas movie? Favorite Christmas movie? I have no idea what the best Christmas movie would be. It would probably probably just be the, uh, you know, the nativity scene. You know, would probably be, you know, if there's a movie that does that, that's probably the best one. Uh, you know, I, there's so many movies that's come out since I was a kid, you know, Miracle on 31st Street and all that. Uh, so, but yeah, I would say uh, if there, if there's a movie that does the nativity scene, that'd probably be the best one because it's the true, it's the true meaning behind the holiday. Uh, ever dressed up as Santa? Yes. One time, uh, it was uh, not at the church I go to now, but at another church I went to. I was a deacon at that time. Uh, and 
all the other deacons had already done it, and it was my turn. And uh, I don't really like having doing Santa Claus at church because it's bringing the worldly crap into church. But the ladies were bound and determined to have Santa Claus at our Christmas party, so I had to do Santa one year at church, and uh, which really just goes against everything I stand for. But I did it. Can't have the pastor's wife mad at you. Anyway, uh, next question, number nine. Ever got anything I didn't like but never said anything? Absolutely. Any guy can answer that one. Yep. When I was a kid, clothes, socks, underwear. Uh, when you're a kid, you want toys. I mean, I wanted the G.I. Joe, the truck, you know, the toys. That's what a boy wants as a kid. Uh it hasn't happened since I was an adult, since I'm an adult now. Rarely. It rarely. Every now and then, Mom will give me something I'll never use. Uh, but, you know, or somebody will give me something I'll never use. But it's rare, and I'm thankful for it anyway. Uh, I know more about what Christmas is really supposed to be about now. So, you know. But as a boy, yeah. Basically every year if I got close. Uh, last question. What is the perfect Christmas time night for you? I don't understand this question. Uh, what is the perfect Christmas time night for you? Uh, like I said, I don't understand that question. Are, are they saying when would I prefer to open presents or something like that? Or, I mean, some people do Christmas morning only. We always opened one. That was our tradition. We opened one on Christmas Eve, typically, you know, sometime after dark. Uh, and then we opened the rest on Christmas Day. That was our tradition. So, uh, or if we didn't open one, we got to open our stockings. A lot of times we did stockings on Christmas Eve and then all the gifts the next day. So I'm not sure if that's what that question is asking for. What's the best Christmas time night for you? That's my answer. I, I don't know because I don't understand the question. Uh, so something fun to do, uh, something different, you know, change it up for the holidays, which just means holy days. That's going to piss people off, but I don't care. It's the truth. Uh, but uh, I saw her doing these questions, and they were fun questions, and uh you know, it. Uh, I know that uh, not everybody enjoys this time of year. I know people have had deaths in the family and stuff. And uh, just remember to be extra, extra kind during this time of year. People really have a lot of struggles, whether it be financially, mentally, whatever. So be super kind this year. And if you see somebody that needs some help, help them out, you know, best you can. Uh, those are my answers to the questions. I hope y'all all, it's early, uh, but I hope y'all all have a blessed, uh, you know, December and blessed Christmas season, blessed Christmas, you know, a safe one as well. Remember, you know, not to be uh, having your cell phone stuck in your face if you're out shopping and stuff. But uh, God bless y'all. This is FSP. We'll check y'all later. It's cold in here.